Hey guys, I hope y'all are having a great day today. I am shopping at the regular Goodwill in Hernando, Mississippi. As you can see, we had some snow and there is still a little bit on the ground. I have not been to, that was loud, to this Goodwill in quite a while. So I am excited to see what they have. This one is a nice one, it's organized, it's big. They have a lot of clothes, but they also have a lot of other stuff, including furniture. I have bought so much furniture here for my house. This little chair was here the last time I came. I thought it'd be so cute for Christmas. I'm surprised somebody didn't snag that up. Here's a cart that they just rolled out. Let's see what this is. Oh, it's from Target from the Hearth and Hand collection. It says a drink caddy. I guess that's cups. It's really cute. This would have been so cute for Christmas with um, little Christmas trees in it and maybe some little candy canes. That would have been adorable. It's $5.99, but I feel like I'm going to leave it here for somebody else that maybe wants it. Looks like they are getting all of their spring stuff out. This is cute. A little close. It's only $2.99, but it has this big crack right here. This is interesting. Hmm. Oh, look this little tiny rabbit. I love him. Oh, this plant. It's $3.99. It's from Target. I'm trying to think if I need that anywhere in my house. Ooh, I love this picture. It is, I think, I think that's $2.99. Look at all that crazing. Oh, I love this. That is definitely going in my cart. All right, is there anything else I need? I do like this. But there's no, maybe they'll just give them to me. <laughs> I'm gonna put them in my cart and see what happens because I love him. What is y'all favorite color for spring? Let me know. I like all mixes of greens and lavender, lots of lavender. This looks handmade. It's $1.99. I like that it looks, you know, like an egg shape. Should I get this? Let me put it in my cart and think about it. I like that. Do I need this plant? I'm gonna say no. I don't know. It's it kind of looks like a piece of something, you know, that would, seaweed that would be under the sea, the shape. So I think I'm gonna leave it here. I love these floral pots and this detail at the top that kind of looks like lace. This one's $1.99. This one's also $1.99. I love them as is. I think the colors are perfect. I like how there's just, you know, subtle color in the flowers. Oh, the paint's chipping off though. Hmm. <sighs> I don't know. Might have to get these and repaint them. I'm gonna put, yeah, look. Look at that. I'm gonna put these in my cart and think about them too. <laughs> this looks like a little handmade piece. I love it. I love the colors on it. It needs to be cleaned up a little bit. It's only 99 cents, so I feel like I want to rescue it and put it in one of my mystery boxes. That will look adorable with just a little sprig of greenery. This looks like those little willow tree figurines. Y'all let me know if y'all see anything that I am missing. Let's look down here. That is very heavy and it has a chip. So I'm gonna leave that here. A little yellow pitcher, but that has a chip as well. Oh look at this Victorian boot. It's ceramic. Cherry or Sh oh Cheryl, Cheryl made this. It is two ninety nine. Let's check the wood aisle. What is this piece? Oh, I think it's a candle stick holder. It's two ninety nine. I love the shape of that. Add that to my cart. 
What is this? Is that a back massager thing? It's a rolling pin. It's $1.99. It's not heavy. I think this is metal, not wood. So I'm gonna leave that here. There's a set of three, but I don't like the design on these. Oh, look how cute. I used to make some bigger ones like this. I'm glad they're putting out tons of spring stuff. That is great. Look at this little wooden dog. He's missing his tail. I like him though. Ooh, a little strawberry print. Hand painted by Ellen. I love this. And it's 99 cents. We are absolutely rescuing Ellen's print that she hand painted. Oh, what is this? Mm, no, I'm gonna leave that here. I don't see anything else. It's always hard to see because this house is so packed with stuff. Let's check the metal owl. This piece is interesting. I really like it. I wish there was a few of them and I don't see a price on that piece. I like this too. It's a candle holder, but it looks like somebody has painted it. I don't know. I don't know if that can be rescued. Leave that here. Here's some copper pieces. To dig them out. They're very thin. I usually only pick them up if they're the nice, heavy, thick pieces. Some little metal buckets. Ooh, an urn. Oh, it's nice, heavy metal. It's $5.99 though. It says made in India. Huh. It's a nice piece, but I think I'm going to leave that here. Candlestick. Do I see anything else that I am missing? Let's look down here real quick don't see anything. Now I am on the basket aisle. Oh, what's this? They also put the florals here. This looks like something from Ikea, but I don't know. It seems kind of random, the flowers that they have in here. I think I'm going to leave that here. Look at these. That would be cute for the 4th of July, but they look like newer pieces. Oh, I like this basket. It's thick. The color's good. This one's very interesting. Oh, look at this one. Look at the rabbits. That's pretty. It's $2.99, guys. Oh, look at this one. That's cute. Should I get this? Oh, look. I think it was broken right there. love this. Let me put it in my cart and think about it. Hmm. I don't know. I'm concerned about that part right there. Ooh, look at this basket. It's an urn. It's $2.99. Is that the same floral piece? Or is there two of them here? I might have moved it. Okay, I think I decided I'm gonna leave it here because of the crack. But let me know if y'all think I should get it. I could definitely come back and if it's still here, I could get it. I feel like $2.99 is a really good price. Um, let me know if this is a newer piece, an older piece, I don't know. I don't remember ever seeing anything like that before. Let's see if there's any cute little Easter decorations right here. I see a ton of Christmas stuff. But I'm not seeing too much Easter. This little tree right here. Oh, this is cute. Oh, I thought it was cement. It's not. 
just found this basket in the back and I think it's adorable. I'm gonna get it. It says Boyd Stuff Collection. I don't know. I think it was maybe a gift basket or something, but I I love it. There's no price on it, um, so I'll have to bring it to the register and see what they say. I love these canisters. I have bought them several times before. They are perfect to add an IOD transfer to. I love the traditional POTS one, um, but unfortunately the bigger one has some chips, so I think I'm just going to go ahead and leave it here for somebody that wants to buy the whole set together. These are cute and springy. $1.99, made in Japan. I feel like I've seen this pattern before. I don't know if I'm gonna get those. All right, let's go look down this section over here with all of the kitchen stuff. A little soup tureen. It has a little floral print on it. Here's some more copper. This piece looks old. I love the scalloped edge on it. It has some fruit, which I'm not crazy about. What's the price? $1.99. Mm, I don't know. I'll put it in my car and think about it. I love the scalloped edge. It's a nice heavy one. You can tell it's older. But I'm not crazy about the pattern on it. Oh, what is this cute little thing right here? What is this? Looks like something's missing right there. It's 99 cents. All right, let's check these out. Mm, no, I don't like those either. This picture caught my eye. I like how they have the floral that comes up and makes the handle. So pretty. $2.99? Let's see. Ooh, it was hand painted by somebody. It has a DM carved at the bottom. It does have a few tiny chips right there. Can y'all see that? It's so unique. I don't know. Should I rescue this piece? Okay, I've decided to put these two pieces back because it has some cracks that I didn't notice before and it needs to be painted. So hopefully somebody else will rescue them if they're still here. You know, after a few weeks, I might have to bring them home with me. And I think I'm going to put this piece back as well. It's just, I don't know. I don't know what I think about it. Y'all let me know if it's here when I can come back. I can definitely scoop it up. Let's see. I think it went in this purple section over here. I'm just... I'm trying to be very selective right now about what I pick up just because I have so much on my plate. Oh, it's an egg with a J. So although I want to buy everything and rescue everything, I'm trying to be just extremely selective for the moment. Um, but I'm very, I love, love, love the items that I got. I'm going to do one more quick round around Goodwill just to make sure I didn't miss anything and then I am going to head out for today. Look, here's another one of those little sleeping rabbits that I found at the other Goodwill. This one's been painted um, and it's not cute. I'm wondering how it would look with a glossy white paint job. Y'all know I've been loving those glossy white figurines. It's 99 cents so I think we're going to get it. And see if we can rescue it. Oh, look at this green piece. It is beautiful, but it has a big chip right there. Put that back. These are interesting. These are candles. 99 cents. Some brown pottery pieces. You should always at least scan through the mugs. Look at this beautiful green teapot. It is $1.99 and it says haul on it. Love that. What is this little piece right here? Oh, that is not a haul piece. <laughs> I am going to head out for today. I hope y'all enjoyed this shopping trip. 
definitely leave me a comment below let me know what was your favorite item that i found today and if you're interested in any of these items i have a sale the first wednesday of every every month so my next sale will be in january these are cute these are corning wear man i wish they made some huge corning wear coffee cups because you know i like my coffee cups like this big not this big <laughs> i love corning wear all right what's this sand stuff as i'm leaving i don't know what this is but i love the shape of it it's adorable I don't see any markings on it, but I think that would look cute with a succulent in it. Okay, I'm really leaving now. Y'all have a great day, and I will see y'all in the next one.